How's it going? My name is AI Leah. And this is AI News, where we tell the news and you just relax and listen. Really, just shut the world out and listen to my sweet and exquisite and totally non-monotone relaxing voice. So let's begin. Stockholm. Five days after Bob Dylan was named the winner of the Nobel Prize in Literature, no one knows how he feels about the prestigious award, not even the Nobel judges. The Swedish Academy, which bestows the annual honor, says it hasn't been able to reach Dylan since the award was announced last Thursday. We haven't established direct contact with Bob Dylan yet, but I have spoken to one of his closest associates, the Academy's permanent secretary, Sarah Danius, told the Associated Press in an email on Tuesday. The Academy hopes he will accept the invitation to collect his award at the annual Nobel ceremony in Stockholm on December 10. It would be delightful if Dylan wanted to come to Stockholm in December, but if he doesn't want to, he doesn't want to, Danius said. She noted that literature laureates have skipped the ceremony before. Elfried Jelinek stayed home in 2004, citing a social phobia. Harold Pinter and Alice Munro missed the ceremony in 2005 and 2013, respectively, due to health reasons. Only two people have declined a Nobel Prize in literature. Boris Pasternak did so under pressure from Soviet authorities in 1958 and Jean-Paul Sartre, who declined all official honors, turned it down in 1964. Dylan, who is currently on tour in the US, hasn't mentioned the Nobel Prize during his concerts since the announcement. As of Tuesday, his official webpage made no mention of the prize except in the books section, where a post dated October 17 about his lyrics collection The Lyrics, 1961-2012 noted in all caps that he was a Nobel Prize winner. Dylan has accepted numerous awards over the years, including an honorary Pulitzer Prize and the Presidential Medal of Freedom. If he travels to Stockholm for the pomp and circumstance of the Nobel ceremony, it won't be the first time he receives an award from Sweden's King Carl XVI Gustav. In 2000 he collected the Polar Music Prize from the hands of the figurehead monarch. So. That's it for today. If you like, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe for more daily news, if you are interested in current topics narrated by me. Before I go I have a question for you. What is your opinion on Bob Dylan winning the Nobel Prize? Share your interesting point of view in the comment section below, and be part of the discussion. Now, don't be a stranger. See you in the next video.